Okay. Hey, numbers. What is good? It is one numerals here. So we got Bankai versus Nixie. This is where the tournament really starts heating up. Yeah, this matchup's gonna be kind of crazy. It's like Falcon hits really hard. Squirtle's at death percent. He's yeah. at super death percent. Yeah, and Bunk Nick is just schmoving around. He'll be able to schmoove as long as uh, Bankai ain't on the stage. Oh, almost ooh, gets killed first. Bankai, Bankai does a really good job of recognizing. Oh, oh, oh my god, almost I can't even baby. talk. Nick is moving too much. All right, so let's see how well uh, Bankai can stop Nick's movements with uh, some well-placed space moves and Razor Leafs. You know, if he gets back on the stage. Oh my god, did he read that? Did he know? That Bankai was just like, I'm gonna do the drop up B, grab the ledge. Nick's like, no, I won't let that happen. I think that would be too hard of something to read, just being like, hey, like, like I know it's like a part of a, like a standard Ivy what? kit type thing. Like, I can't believe uh, Nick made the decision to do that. It wasn't he almost went for it again. He was just like, I might have enough time for this. He went late that time, though. Yeah, well, might have enough time for this. All right, let's see what Bankai's up to. He's not, uh, uh. he's not throwing an early down air, so Nick's just gonna. Is he dead? Oh my god. Oof. My guy's like, here come the up airs. The big old uh, flower poop. Look at Charizard. It's like, no, punch me instead. I mean, it's not very effective against Charizard, don't you know? This is gonna be. This is really difficult because Nick like. Is not letting him off the ledge. Yeah. Because they have a character like Kevin Falcon uh, versus like big oh target my God. like Zard. It's like, how many attempts did he get to two frame down air? All right, okay. immediately switches to Ivy Star. Bankai realizes. Uh, well, I mean, like he's at super high percent, so it's just like, what's he gonna do with Squirtle at that point? And uh, yes. No, I can't imagine that Bankai is gonna stick with uh, Squirtle for too long. Because. Well, Nick's just been winning the speed game, honestly. He's been moving, 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 schmoving. Hey, anyway, let's see what happens. Right off the back, it's a, it's a good hit. Ivy Sword's got plenty of combo, combos for fast fallers like Captain Falcon. That's, yeah, he tried to get him, and, he, and that's still his double grab. Nick, Nick and Bankai both recognize this. Ah. Oh, he knows the trick. Nice. I bet it was because of me. It was because of me. Because of me. Ah, get out of here. Yeah, hey, get out of here. Bunkai has pulled a little bit of momentum on his side, but it's definitely way too late for it to matter in this game, that's for sure. Unless he can hit one of those ratchet. Really? Too big wow. a blow. Wow. Too big a blow. My man is dead in the water. And that, for Charizard, that's a bad thing. So Nick's going to get rid of Battlefield and... The other battlefield? No, Lila. Oh, Lila. The other, other battlefield. Uh, the other white beam. And joining us is. Hello. Uh, I think it's Blue. Hello. Blue, Blue Spot. Blue Point. Mm -hmm. No, Cyan Point was uh, was Freelancer Leo. Yeah. If that was Blue Spot, I'd be totally ripping off his whole thing. I'm sorry. Green vector. line segment. A green vector. Green vector. Like the crocodile. Hi, John. Hi, Red Line. That was a very interesting game. Nixie has been pretty much tearing it up thanks to 3.1. Yeah. I mean, he's, he's also, also an incredible talent. He's been doing this before the boss. Oh, yeah. He just doesn't let the opponent move because he wants to move. Yeah. Nick wants to move. He's going to move. I think when Nick does it, it qualifies as schmoove. Bankai is trying his best to keep pace with Squirtle, who has the speed, frame data, and all that to keep up oh, with yeah. Falcon. But, like, Nick's been playing this kind of game since the beginning of Smash 4. He knows what movement is. But hey, unlike the first game, Bankai's got his uh, Squirtle Roots this time. 50 damage. That's about what you want when you get a Squirtle Root. Let's see what we got. Nice, mi nice mix-ups. Tell to me about Shell Slide. Shell Slide? Uh, it's got armor. Simple as that. Percentage, not back or super. Uh, it's sort of super, but the harder of a move you hit Squirtle with, the more you'll slow him down. Got it. If you can make him stop or go backwards, he will... Uh, Lose his hitbox. Nice uh, tether through the down air. Anyway, what I was thinking is that Ivy Sword would be the best choice in this matchup. Not because Falcon is fast, because honestly, Bankai should get off Ivy as fast as possible if Falcon gets too close. But, but 
if he has some distance and has IV, you should just see if he can stop some movement with uh, spaced aerials and Razor Leafs. Razor Leafs are traditionally pretty good at stopping fast movers. Do you think? But it ain't Ivy's, working here. Do you think Ivysaur still wins the offstage game in this matchup? Uh, I mean, it depends on if he can read Nick's movements offstage, which he hasn't been doing a good job. I think he needs to calibrate his calibrate his instruments to figure out what he has to do next. Gross. Anyway, that back air was pretty good. Calibrate his senses. That's what I meant to say. All right, Ivy combos. Nice. Oh wait, Bankai took first blood. There you go. Yeah. He got it with the Charizard back air. Tethers are way too hard to edge guard. I know that there is some discussion on that subject. I know. We're For Falcon. Yes. For Falcon, it's hard. Went for the turnaround knee, trying to really bully this portal. Oh, yeah. All right. Immediately goes off to Ivysaur. Wants to see what nice. he can do. Nice air dodge. And I like, what, all right. I like what he did there. The moment Bankai even had a semblance of advantage, he immediately switched to Ivysaur. Get the juggles going in a way that Squirtle never could. So let's see what Nick's going to do. Wow. 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 Oh, my God. Oh. Any other character would have gotten hit by that. Well, not all of them. Oh. Oh, my God. That Me was insane. Blue. Nick, you can't do that. Clip that. Oh, my God. Never fear. Our wonderful caster is clipping every kill. Very nice spot dodge read from Bankai. Not as glamorous as what Nick did, but it got the job done. Ivysaur F smash is like oh, wait. one of the great underrated pullback F smashes. Oh, yeah. That's pretty good at avoiding a move, too, if he accidentally shoots it the wrong way. That's what I mean, the pullback. Oh, I know. And he lets it rip and, in the wrong direction. And then it can't get punished from behind if they're not careful. Oh, he can still get punished. I, if they're not careful. Hey, let's if continue. Ooh. act too rashly. Bankai showed lag right in Nick's face. You'd never want to show lag in Nick's face. Because he will push. Ooh. What's he going to do? All right. Grab. So I've been seeing this from a lot of players ever since we figured out the 11 hit rule on rapid jabs. Uh, people are just letting it go on the 11th hit. You know, try to bait out the roll at the perfect yeah. time. There's a mix-up for that. You just don't roll. don't roll. Wait till like hits 12 or 13. Nice roll read. Gets the down smash. Not enough. If it was a tipper, maybe. Ooh, goes for jab. Have a tipper? Yes. Oh, back air. Right in the bulb. Looks like it hurt. Right in the flower. That's probably a sensitive part for Ivysaur. Show me the knee on the flare blitz again. If yeah, we have please that. Show me the knee on the flare blitz. That's, oh, yes. Oh, yes. All right. So let's see how early he figured out he had to do this. He just went. The moment he heard it. Yes. The pull back oh. into it so that he was crossing. So like, oh, Falcon. You know what? I can't do this. The camera's all the wrong way around. It's fine. 